Hello, Joshua P. Warren here. I am in the Mount Hermon Masonic Temple in Asheville, North Carolina, and we've discovered a very interesting phenomenon here. Uh, this is a Dr. Goss electromagnetic field meter, and it's used to pick up a variety of electromagnetic frequencies. Uh, we have several swords here. Uh, one is a Japanese wakazashi, the others are you know, various uh, dress type swords. And uh, if we measure them for electromagnetism, you will see that we don't pick up anything special. Uh, they shouldn't be producing any type of an electromagnetic pulse, and they are not. That's why it's so strange for us to conduct this test on this sword, which is the Tyler's sword, which is used outside of the Masonic Lodge. This sword is pulsating with electromagnetism. This is the sword that is used to symbolically secure the meetings while they are in session, which has been an especially important task in the, in the history of Masonry when, say, uh, the Revolutionary War, the Civil War was taking place. And so uh, there is a lot of uh, thought put into this particular device. And as you can see, it is just beaming with electromagnetism. We can't understand why conventionally that should be the case. Uh, it is inexplicable. 